Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Conan Exiles. It's been a very long time since I last uploaded, um, but I do have a plan for this episode. And from what I can tell, I do believe that I've finally sorted out the issues that I was having with my mic. Uh, touch wood, because I don't know. <laughs> I haven't been able to test it just yet. So anyway, uh, what I want to do is uh, with the iron that we got last episode, I do remember mentioning saying that everything was really slow when it comes to crafting it. And after doing some research, just minor stuff, it turns out that you can massively increase the production rate of things if you use thralls, so uh, the fancy way of saying slaves. <laughs> so off camera, I've just essentially built a little hut off the off light to the side. Uh, it's nothing fancy. I just hope it's big enough to fit the actual device in. Um, I think from what we needed, um, where is it? It's in here somewhere. Uh, that's it, there we go. So lesser wheel of pain. So I need 30 rope, 210 wood, uh, 220 wood, sorry, 210 stone, 75 iron. Now, okay, so we have, we do have enough. Okay, so I, I was worried that we didn't have enough of this stuff. <laughs> the hell am I over encumbered in? Uh, all right, so I got nine. I need 21 of this. So there we go. That should be 21 there. I got my twigs from when I was doing the uh, the roof of this because I need to add a roof to that one. And uh, what I'm going to do at some point is dismantle the roof of that, turn it into a storage shed, and instead just have like a large cooking area in the middle of uh, the city, if you will, because that's the that's like the end game for this. Is I want to have a living city kind of thing. Now I was a little bit oversold when it comes to the actual like living, if you will, of the AI. <laughs> They don't actually wander around as much as you would hope. So, uh, so what is it I need? I need 30 rope. And this is my like a random chest of stuff that I've collected off camera to save time. It's been so long since I've actually done some like decent recording and uh, I, I've really missed it. I really missed it. But yeah, um, I covered a lot of like heavy things recently. Uh, I've also got to talk to you about the charity event that we're doing because I will be mentioning it every episode. So all I can really say is sorry, um, but it's something that I really believe in and I want to support. Uh, at the moment, we are doing a charity fundraiser for the next four to five weeks with Special Effect. Uh, special Effect are a non-profit organization that use specialist technology and work very closely with hardware and software developers to create alternatives for people who suffer with disabilities to be able to game and like play, enjoy life kind of thing. Um, this is in honor of my college lecturer who passed away recently. Uh, he, he himself was uh, confined to a wheelchair, but like he never let that stop him. And that's where like the inspiration for this charity fundraiser comes from is I want his like legacy to live on, if that makes sense. Wait, so does this come with a dude? Do we get a, do we get a free dude? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, I I will be talking about that. Okay. So is that? It? <laughs> but yeah, I will be I will be talking about that uh, at least like once an episode. The link for it will be in the description. All of these will fall under the tag for special effect. Uh, the fundraiser. I'm gonna keep it open afterwards, but I'm gonna just send it so that the donations go directly to them. Whereas at the moment, it all kind of gets massively banked up, I think, and then gets sent to them. <laughs> so, you know, we've still got a bit of work. Uh, at the moment, we're 5% of the way there, though. So a huge thank you to everybody who has donated and anybody who's interested in doing so can find the link down below. But anyway, yeah, so, bam. I think that was a pretty well done, you know, it's not sponsored, by the way, but I think there was a pretty well done sponsored segment if... If it was, you know, <laughs> uh, I think I did very well there. <laughs> I'm proud of myself. I remember doing the video uh, whenever it comes to me sitting there and just doing a video instead of just playing like the game alongside doing a video. So the way that I did the like announcement, I get really awkward and for some reason really scared. <laughs> so, I, so I end up just sitting there and mumbling for most of it. I know that the audio was already off as well, which made it so much worse. But yeah, hopefully it'll be a lot more natural coming into things, you know? I think I've... Like, I th I'm sure I've unlocked, like, the wall-hanging torches now. I'm, I mean, I've got to get get close, you know? Got to get to be close. Yeah. 
I can English very well. But yeah, I uh, I've been looking at some place to uh, to stay essentially, and um, it looks very well. I don't know what that oil is. Huh? Could that be like honey or something? Or is it the uh, poison that the that the uh, what's it called dropped? Wrong thing. Because it could be the poison that we got from that spider. I don't know where I've actually put that, but um, I could go and have a look. Uh, I'm sure I've got two of those torches. Yeah. Uh, okay, maybe if I... Do I have to do that and then do it? No, it still says I don't have one. Branch and a torch. Uh, oh, improvised torch. I've built the wrong ones again. Okay. Oh, great. <laughs> so they're useless, basically. Uh, what I can do then is drop. Uh, drop. So I need three torches. Like the, the good ones. Right, one, two, three. Uh, is that right? No, I just need two. Uh, so one more. Oh, so yeah, I've just realized as well. It tells me items required. I don't know why I've not been using that. So leather. Okay, so branch, plant fiber, and leather. Uh, for this, I need more twine. I'll maybe make like three of them just in case. Uh... Yep. Okay. What else? <laughs> I'm getting there slowly but surely. I know I've got so much to do and I'm so very far from like making a difference in the Conan world, you know? <laughs> but the plan is there. The plan is there. I'm thinking of, like I've already said, uh, well, mentioned the whole like admin commands for getting like wood and stuff and somebody did say that they don't mind me doing that so i've been considering it but i don't really like cheating when it comes to these survival games even for the playthrough it's just not really worth it if i'm gonna play it i may as well play it properly um but i have been considering just upping the crafting speed of certain things because sometimes it can take an abysmal amount of time for me to uh you know be able to to craft things <laughs> uh, the only thing i've like really use the server commands for at the moment is just making it daytime so when i come on and like try to record but it's it's nighttime i'll whack it through to daytime just to make sure it's easier to get the intro done because i'd rather it go from day to night while i'm playing instead of night to day i'm loving having the torches at the intro uh, like the the intro <laughs> the entrance to everything at the moment so that's something that i'm gonna stick to as like a design choice um, I like the idea of having windows in there, so I'm going to keep them too. Uh, what I need to do though is get rid of this because that's probably weighing me down a little bit. You don't, you don't, like you don't realize just how much things weigh in this game until you've like got a thousand plant fiber or something. <laughs> uh, bam! All right, yeah. I mean, it was only two, but I can also put my iron back in here. Uh, just for now because it's like a, a very like used building area like I have this chest for things that I need like then and there just to stop me from having to run in and out of the warehouse but I will be doing that at some point <laughs> uh, I will be doing everything I can to make sure this is somewhat of like a an RP kind of thing so I need two more of them Right, leather. Okay, so how do I make leather is the question. Would it be in here? Uh, nope. Okay. What about... No, but I can make some more fine crafted things. There are loads of hide. But I don't have the leather for it. Icor. Okay. Uh, brimstone. 
dry wood. I, I don't even know how I got that. <laughs> okay, so how do we make leather? <clears throat> I'm assuming we need the tanning bench, which I have finally gotten around to making. Or like, I've got the, the recipe for it now. Bark. Okay. So I'm assuming for that I'll need... Uh... Not a, not a, like this one, I think. Stone skinning knife. Five branches, 20 stone. Okay, so. Uh-huh. Take. Take. And I only need one of these. It's the only thing I can think of is like using a skinning knife on a tree. I mean, that's what you would do in real life, is you'd go to a tree and just start hammering away with a knife, right? <laughs> Don't even want to know the hand signal I just did. It was only after I'd done it, I'd realized. Uh, okay. Uh, what else can I quickly do? Clear up a spot. This is the only thing I can think of doing. <laughs> no, okay, so it's not that. <laughs> uh, so how the hell do you get bark? Is it maybe... Maybe you think I have to use this for? No? No, okay. Uh, hmm. All right. Uh, I don't know what the hell to do. Huh. Okay. Uh, is there a crafting recipe? Or is it in the feats? Where would it be? No. Looks like loo roll. <laughs> uh, okay, so. Chopping wood. A construction signpost. No. Huh. Okay. I'm really confused. As to what it is that we do to get bark. Uh, do I hit a tree with my sword? Is that something I do? Do I use a pickaxe on a tree? I'm really lost. Alright, so not that. <laughs> uh, okay, pickaxe on a tree. Got there in the end. <laughs> That one gave me nothing. Okay, how much bark is it we needed? Uh, I'd like to think I'm getting a lot done per episode, but at the same time, and I don't really—I haven't really watched anybody else's playthrough. I need 38 bark. All right, well it's night time, so I'm gonna cut to morning and keep at this. So I'll see you then. All right, so, I mean, it's morning now, but we still don't have enough bark. But uh, it's all right. You can join me for the last few. <laughs> I've managed to deforest nearly half the island. And I think I'm on 34 bark. Yeah, I was on 34, now 35. So I need three more. It's not a lot, and I know I can get it. It's just the fact that I've literally been doing this an entire night. I wonder whether there's like a, a different tool I can use. I've just realized I've now got enough. Uh, don't want to waste the rest of the wood. So, we'll go for that. It's cool how there's different resources for specific things that you mine. Uh, but it can also be very confusing. I don't know whether that's just me, though. <laughs> I mean, some of the little icons as well, like the decals, if you will, for for the items, uh, it can be really confusing. Like The bark looked a lot like leather to me, but I, I you know, I play, played a bit of Minecraft in my time, you know? <laughs> It looks, uh, it looks a lot like Schwachscraft, their uh, leather, or at least what it used to be. 
I have not played Minecraft now for about nine years, maybe, no, a little bit less than that, maybe seven years, I don't, I don't know, it's been, it's been a long time, a very long time, alright, so what is it I need, I need this, uh, already forgot, twine, so I need plant fibre, uh, loot, loot, question mark, uh, Okay, that, that, hopefully that's that's everything. <laughs> uh, I can't remember though. I know it needs a lot of a lot of rope. All right, I need two hundred and forty stone as well. I need twenty rope. <laughs> okay, craft. There we go. Man, you just chew through your stone like this takes me like hours off camera to go and mine, and it barely lasts gone within seconds like uh thinking maybe have the tanning rack here just extend this out one more yeah okay yeah yeah let's do that Getting better at clicking the right button as well. <laughs> um, all right, so what is it I need? Uh, maybe like 10 of them just to be safe. Okay, we'll craft that first. Uh, that can go there. See, see, look at that. Look at how long that tanning rack is ticking over. <laughs> ah, we'll get there, you know. How's everybody been? <laughs> Time for one of those awkward moments where I just try and keep a conversation going with myself. I'm over encumbered. It's more stone that I need. Uh, Alright, so one two, three, four, maybe, because this is the one that goes down as well. Uh, uh, in fact, no, I didn't even need it. Ah, gonna build it anyway. <laughs> uh, okay, I can take that off. Um, what I can do is work that in there, and in fact, uh, very quickly, I want to build a little, a uh, little pillar, and I want to have it supporting like a little roof or something. Uh, bam. Huh. There's no, um, there's no like thatch flat roofs, so I can only really do this. to be over one more <laughs> okay so where oh god i've lost my cursor this is the only problem with playing on like a proper tv instead of instead of a monitor <laughs> okay there we go all right uh bam take this and this this don't need that anymore don't need that don't need this. Don't need that. Uh-huh. Okay. So. What I need is... Uh, we'll go for two of them. And that should be enough. Uh, bam. No, 
Come on, stop playing up. <laughs> I need another three ceiling as well. One, two, three. Bam, 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 bam. What I want is this there. That one there. One, two. There we go. All right. Now the tanning rack can go like that. Bam done now I can put this here here like that. and double check that this is what I needed bark and thing into leather okay yeah all right sorted so that is the leather for when we need it I don't know what the conversion rate is though so 27 hide we can put in there I think I've got three bark left in here I hope I can send Thrells out to collect materials for me. <laughs> right, so I can make eight leather from just them three bark. Okay. All right, well, on that, I guess we will leave the episode there. I'll speak to you all later. I love you all and see you in the next one. Bye-bye.